And amid worries over falling trading volumes, head of the Financial Supervisory Commission, Li Ruiteng, is planning to propose a series of tax reductions. A plan to cut transaction taxes and restore a full tax credit on dividend income are among the measures he's reportedly considering bringing up with Finance Minister Xu Yuzhe later this month. A rally across European and American markets bolstered the local bursts, which today closed slightly up at around 9,000 points. But low trading volumes persisted, despite a move by the FSC to expand the number of stocks eligible for day trading by 23, effective yesterday. Things are going slowly, but the reaction so far is good. To help prop up the TIEX, the FSC is looking to reduce transaction taxes for day traders and to boost trading gains by reclassifying that taxable income and applying a graduated rate based on personal income. The FSC is also considering reinstating a full tax credit on stock dividend income after previously having that credit assessed on business income tax and retained earnings. We need to thoroughly discuss this matter with the finance minister. Some 70 percent of stocks listed on the TIEX are trading at volumes of fewer than 200,000 shares per day, an inertia that the FSC wants to fix by loosening taxes. Attention now turns to the finance ministry and whether they'll sign off on the plan.